Alfa Romeo's camouflage car as Valtteri Bottas livery kept under wraps at F1 testing. Alfa Romeo's latest recruit Valtteri Bottas tested his new car for the 2022 season under camouflage, with his livery design for the new campaign kept under wraps. Bottas made the move to Alfa Romeo after five years at Mercedes alongside seven-time world champion Lewis Hamilton. Despite performing as one of Formula One's strongest drivers, the Finn often featured as a wingman for Hamilton however the move to a new team gives him the chance to be main man. The 32-year-old was out on the track in his new car for the very first time this week, as teams went through their testing for the upcoming campaign. However, Alfa Romeo chose to drive Botos in a camo-covered vehicle during the Barcelona test, with his new team livery kept under wraps until the season begins next month. The Swiss-based team endured a disappointing season in 2021 finishing in ninth, with only the pointless Haas finishing below them in the constructors' standings. In spite of this the signing of one of the sport's strongest drivers Botos, shows Alfa Romeo are looking to climb their way up this table this time around, and compete towards the other end of the standings. Ahead of the upcoming season, Botos has revealed he still hasn't given up the dream of becoming a world champion but insisted his main focus to begin with is getting his new team on the podium. He said, I still haven't given up the goal that I have, it's to one day win the championship, so that's always going to be the dream, Botos said. But for now, I dream that we can make a good step forward as a team. And I feel like consistently scoring points would be a big achievement already, and even him secretly dreaming about being on the podium with an Alfa Romeo. One aspect that could give Alfa Romeo and some of the less competitive teams a better chance in 2022 is new vehicle regulations that have been put in place to make races much more tighter and competitive. As a result, Botos revealed he is looking forward to competing under the new rulings, and expects a closer contest throughout the season. He continued, I feel like it's going to be exciting because with what I've learned from the regulations, so many things are now restricted on what you can do in each area. Between the teams, the car designs aerodynamically and mechanically, it's not a huge difference you can make. So, I think the whole season is going to be hopefully much closer. We're going to see different drivers on the podium, different orders in the top 10, small teams as well will have great opportunities. So, I think as a whole season, we're looking at something quite exciting. I think it's going to be good to watch and good to drive.